Hello everybody, I'm FHRC Brony. Um haven't really done a serious video for, on this one, so no intro for uh, formal videos like this. Um, RCs, I'll, I'll, let's talk about that real quick. Although I haven't quit RCs, I mean I still got my four, my four tech and my slash over there in the background. Uh, although I am not quitting RC still. Um, there hasn't been a lot of videos lately because I mean you guys are probably gonna get bored of seeing the same thing in same car in the same setup all the time. So my plan is is actually to slow it down just a little bit and work on some more Forza speed paints and stuff like that and all in all Forza videos and and stuff and MLP related things. So RC is just gonna be slowed down just a little bit. However, I am gonna be telling you my updates on the on RCs, which is I am going to be upgrading that to brushless. Um, my my Fortec will be upgrading to brushless soon, and the slash will stay stock. Why am I gonna stay stock on off roads? Because I'm not really gonna. I don't really want to go fast on off roads. So, and plus I'm mostly driving on the streets, so I'm just gonna let my Fortec take the brushless system. I am gonna be putting a castle system on it, but I just don't know which one. I'm either thinking about going to Ghoul RC or. Castle because I heard of ghoul RCs are pretty cheap and they're pretty decent, but we'll see what happens though I, I really kind of I really trust um, castle more, but we'll see from there um, uh, And also I, I always get this a lot from people especially YouTube commenters and it kind of really gets me bothered at uh, sometimes and um, Stuff like that so especially when I do artwork and because I have deviant art and especially when I go to when I do artwork or make something, people are just gonna be saying, "Oh, can you make this for me? Can you do this? Can you do that?" I mean, first of all, I, I thank you, thank you for everybody who is trying to send requests and stuff like that, and you know, showing your enthusiasm and so much how much you really love to see your things being done in my work. Although I really appreciate that, I cannot. I cannot take requests at all. Sorry, I couldn't do that. Um, like, if, if someone's gonna tell me that that they want have they want me to do some artwork for them, um, they have to pay me a commission. Meaning, I ha they have to pay me to do something for them. So, I mean, you guys are lucky that I don't know how to do that at the moment. I don't know how to do commission or any online transaction because I'm all, I'm an old school dude. I'm, I'm an old school guy. I was born in the early 2000s and I haven't really adopted to buying something um, buying something from online. The only thing that I can actually do when it comes to transactions is through just cash. Like that's the only thing I know. I mean that's the only thing that I could do because it's, you know, it's easier to be done. And since now these technologies are coming out, uh, these technologies about Online transactions. I mean, I knew I already knew online shopping and online transactions are are a thing w when I was a kid, though. like when I was like like seven or eight years old. But I just haven't really adopted it yet, and I'm already I'm already entering the the adulthood here soon. I'm already eighteen, and adult adult life is coming really soon. So I really need to adapt some of those new things in into myself because this is how am I going to survive. But the thing is, the point is, I generally couldn't re take any requests. I'm I'm very sorry, but I really do appreciate how much enthusiasm you guys have. The reason why I just don't, the reason why I don't take requests is it's very simple. It's not just it's not just because of the money. Let's say let's say I I taken the request though, like I, I you didn't have to pay me anything. Just let's just put it this way, if I taken someone's request. And then I make a speed paint out of it, or something like that. Then everybody on the comments, or anywhere in social media, or even in in person, they're gonna be saying, "Can you make this? Can you make this? Can you make this?" Basically, what I'm trying to say is, if I take, if I accept some guy's request, the other person is assuming that, "Oh, this guy is taking requests. I should ask him." And I don't want to go through that mess. And then there's this one dude who subscribed to my channel and is saying that. Oh, uh, a YouTuber is supposed to listen to their subscribers or whatever watchers they, they or whether watchers and yeah, nah, nah, nah. Are you serious? Like, are you 
you, are you really putting that philosophy in there? I That is the most stupidest philosophy I ever heard in my entire life when it comes, especially in my in my years at YouTube. I've been on YouTube since uh, 2013 with my other, with my first channel, Golden State Warriors number one fan. I've been I've been around on YouTube for since 2013. I I've been here for a while. So FHRC Brony didn't come out six years. Uh, sorry, not six years. FHRC Brony didn't come out like um, three years later. So I just just because you don't get what you want doesn't mean you have to get mad at me because I did not accept your request because honestly I'm not taking any request. I love to, but I just couldn't because there's too there's good other people will assume that oh uh this guy is already taking the request. I should ask him. I don't want to go through that mess. I really do love to make something for you guys, but I just couldn't do it and I just really hate it when people like say oh can you make this can you make this can you make this can you make that can you make this for me come on guys give me a break I play a lot of Xbox I'm go I'm in college right now I'm working I'm not working but I'm actually trying to uh, to to be my be the best who I can I, I'm actually majoring as a mechanic as a mechanical technician here or an auto automotive technician and I love cars I love everything about the cars I love everything about a car I really do and I also really love the way you guys have your much your much enthusiasm helping and sending me in requests I really do love how you guys really interact and stuff but the thing is I just couldn't take requests because otherwise I will overwork myself and I'm sorry that I'm rambling about this I'm sorry that I'm that I'm really repeating myself a lot. It's just I really need to emphasize this because if I took if I took a request from someone, the other person is going is going to say that oh this guy is doing it. I should ask him. Yeah, I know. I said that like four or five times right now. I have to say it a lot of times because I want people I want people to understand because not a lot, not a lot of people can just have common sense and rewind this video and say oh this guy cannot take requests that I should not I should not ask him and this one dude like I said I mentioned this one dude is telling me that oh a YouTuber should should listen to their subscribers okay first of all no absolutely not a YouTuber does what he wants to do unless unless if it's for the people, for for the YouTube uh, people who are watching a video, like uh, whatever whatever they want to watch, and this is like, eh, not everybody wants to follow what the what the YouTubers say. I mean, it's great. I mean, I'm not trying to say that I'm not taking anything. Okay, it doesn't mean that I'm that I'm. You guys are talking to me through a brick wall. It's not that. It's just. I want to go my own ways. This is my channel, and I love to do it my own way. Okay, I love to do it my way. Okay, Golden State Warriors number one fan, FHRC Brony, Radio Control and Cars, which is this channel, and my music channel, FHRC Brony, NLP Projects and Music. Everything in that and on those three channels are all done my way. Okay, I love the only thing that I would actually take any suggestions from you guys is actually trying to make. Try to make say like, um, can you like add this to your video? Like you know, just try to like. Basically, what I'm trying to say is like improve on something. Like, do you guys want me to add something that I can improve on? Something like that is great. But when you take when I'm taking request, that's a whole different story. When you're sending in some, when you're sending a YouTuber suggestions, that's a different story. I I think that's the same. I think that's the thing that this one YouTuber, one subscriber of mine was trying to say. Um, is is like can you like try to add something to like improve something on your channel can you like can you like add this effect or can you add this to improve your videos or something something like that is fine but when i take requests and saying and uh, people like like can you do this for me or can you do this for me can you do that i can't do that suggestions yes i can but requests no okay so hopefully i got that in in your head though okay uh, I just want I know like I said I've been saying that over five six times already but the thing is not a lot of people have the common sense to rewind a video just to put things under head I'm not saying that you are one of them I'm just saying 
can be anybody, including myself. I, sometimes I don't have the best of common sense. And I try to do my best to improve myself on it. Because, you know, I'm starting to become an adult soon. Well, I technically am because I'm 18 and I'm act that's actually the a legal age. But I'm not officially an adult until I'm 21. So, uh, like I said, I'm sorry that I, I couldn't take requests. But I hope you understand this. Like I said, I said this already five, six times right now. So, I hope you guys understand that. And uh, I get a little bit, I get a little bit of stressed out when people say, "Can you do this? Can you do that? Can you do this for me?" and stuff like that. Like, um, especially it's not just here on YouTube. It's also on DeviantArt and Facebook, everywhere, anywhere on social media that I, that I'm in. So, hopefully that would. Uh, sorry for my little rant on that, and sorry if I get a little. I kind of got a little pissed off at it, but hope you guys kind of under, really understands this. So um, that's all for now. I'll talk to you guys again soon.